This week is, we are one week out at this point. Um, we're like six days out at this one, I feel like. Um, anyways, if you ask me how I'm doing, I'm gonna be honest with you, I am tired. I'm mentally drained and I am physically exhausted. But that is where we're supposed to be right now. So this week we actually went to the Battle Axe Gym in Miami um, and we had a great time. We had to wake up really early in the morning to get there. It's about a two hour drive for us, so we woke up at three, left around 3.45, got there at 6.15, 6.30, and then had to do all three lifts. <laughs> so that was, that was a fun time. Um, but it's always a good time when we're at Battle Axe. Being around Mike is just always like, it always brings me confidence in the lifts because he's just, He's just a really good coach, and he always gives me that like extra little like oomph that I need. So we had a really good time there. Um, we found our openers, where I found my openers, and then we kind of discussed a plan going forward. So I'm really happy. I feel really good going into this week, um, really confident. And then this week, being one week out, we're just working on mobility. We're working on stretching. Um, just keep staying uh, moving, but also being really concerned with recovery and rest so that come meet day on Saturday, um, we are showing up as our best selves. So yeah, we're getting, it's getting really, really real at this point. So Mike disclaimer, um, Mike is a very passionate person, which means that um, with passion comes curse words and <laughs> vulgarity at times. Um, but that's what we love about him. So if that offends you in any way, please do not watch this video. Um, we are not going to censor him a whole lot because then it just ruins the message. And in between all the vulgarity and the curse words is really um, important, passionate information and um, just like a lot of really just, just things you need to hear. Like if you ever need to, need to get hype, go to Mike. Um, so with that said, again, if cursing and vulgarity offends you, please don't watch this video. You can just skip this one and we'll watch the next one next week. <laughs>
best. If you're out there cleaning the bathrooms, I want you to fucking use a toothbrush if you want. I don't care. But this is the next one. <laughs> and that bad bitch kills us all, dog. And she's super successful. She's cleaning the bathroom. So think about it. That's the same attitude. We're for all walks of life. From fucking low life criminals to fucking doctors and lawyers. We're all the same now. That's the attitude. I cannot express this enough. They don't understand what power that it means to a lot of people. They don't get it. They don't know what it feels like when you get that done. They, they don't conceptualize that. That's not their fucking problem. It's our job to show them, not tell them, why this shit matters. So you guys must have that attitude. You all know here in this room, for the most part, what competition feels like in your bones. And some of us know what it feels like when it's stripped away from you. And that's why we're fucking tenacious. So that's the attitude I'm telling you right now. You may sleep less, you may come in hurt, you may have 20, 30 fucking emails to answer, your kids are gonna be fucking mad, you're not gonna sleep, I don't give a fuck! I've been doing that shit for 10 years. And before that, lots of brain damage. Today the attitude is to help them. If you don't know what to do, the guys that are gonna be loading, if you can stay, load the plates, talk to each other. My lifters, you guys need to know what warm up you want, what you want on the bar, and yes, today will be a little stressful. Too bad. You're in a stressful sport. I want you to go into next week confident. This is not a week to figure things out. You're merely expressing how we're going to kickstart your success next week. No one's gonna cheerlead you the day alone. You know what's fun? Winning is fun. Go have fun. You ever lost before? You ever failed? It's not fun, dog. You ever hurt yourself? It sucks dick. You know what's fun? Winning is fun. Doing what you set out to do is fun. Impressing your friends is fun. Being a fuckhead is stupid and not fun. But understand why we're here. Stick to the plan, know your numbers. The guys that are prepping for Florida's will get that together too, right? Now I'm at your service. I'm done for the most part for training. I'm just here for chilling out. If you need questions and stuff, let's get it. But remember the attitude that I want. You are here to fuck shit up. Deal? All right, let's go. side story <laughs> <laughs> I'm just happy. I feel like everything's moving really, really well. So I'm excited. 
thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I can't wait for meet day and I hope that you guys are enjoying this so far. Um, if you have any questions, please put them in the comments below and we will tag the invite everybody here um, so that you guys can check them out too. Oh, I thought it was like a <laughs> Read that later. Uh, yeah, I'm not reading Read this now. That, that better not be on fucking. I'm reading that by myself. Where did you find that? On the internet. Is that dope? Fuck yeah, it is. <laughs> That's the real weird <laughs> thing. Thank you. It says a lot. One thing we Forever. <laughs> Every time you wear that Wolverine shit, I'm like. Because <laughs> I'm wearing it. <laughs> I, hate I literally matching. named my dog X Men. I know, like, and Logan. I'm like, oh, I love <laughs> See me and my cousin? <laughs> He's eating grass too, chill. That's me. Good, because this goes with my Bronco. Okay. How do I look? Cute? Perfect. Alright, don't get that.